best part is, of course, driving on the racetrack. And what better car could you drive in than an SLS AMG? Now, the exercise we're going to do now is called lead follow. And basically, you drive behind a real pro who knows the ideal line and you try to emulate him. Now, is it easy? No, not at all. Because these guys really know the, their stuff. And amateurs like myself really hang on to dear life to stick right behind them and follow their example. almost to this first apex in the course group. That's what it takes to get the car online and then use all the road at the exit. Pretty much a quick upshift right the track out of course group if you do a manual mode. So that was the warm-up lap. Now starts the fun. Finding the apex of the curve and looking where you're going is extremely important. So as soon as you get to the exit of four here, start stretching the legs, full throttle, all the way to the red bridge. And then of course when you accelerate, ah, oh, it's just a dream. As soon as the car's gone by, tuck in behind, get right back to full throttle. Now we're going uphill towards the corkscrew. Go easy on the brakes here. Before you turn into the course here, here we go. Left, down, and right. Oh, nice. Remember a little early break for nine so that you're back on the gas as you turn in. We're doing one more doing one more session. Class, it's a little yeah. bit more like a recap, so. Yeah. Well, I've driven the C63 on the streets. Now, it's time to test it around the lap. And with all the competition out there, SLS, uh, CLK63 Black Series, this baby will probably score with its nimbleness. Should be third here. I released my brakes a little too early. Got a big push, understeer. Quick up shift to fourth. Back down to third, get the car balanced, roll to that throttle. Also, something to think about is sometimes you can slow down a car even quicker without engaging ABS. ABS is a great uh, safety tool, but oftentimes we try to stay away from ABS, just one tick short of it, so that nothing is uh, releasing brake pressure for us, except our right foot. Okay, that looked like we got in the corner a little bit early that time. After having driven on the track, we're now analyzing every little turn, every little straight, every little movement of the head, the hands, and by looking at every little detail, we try to become better. You have very poor vision at 170 miles an hour without any eyeglasses. It's a tight little course, which we're going to be driving with a SLK 55, a nice little nimble car with awesome power. The trick here is not to be too aggressive, to be smooth around the corners, and not to put the power down too quickly because otherwise this thing will fishtail. But as it is nimble, it's made for this per uh, little tiny circuit here. And of course, it wouldn't be AMG if it wouldn't be competitive. So everyone really, really, really wants to win here. And uh, is it fun? Oh. Hell yes, it is. So I can't wait to get in here and hopefully score a decent time. Push it, nice, nice. Light break through here, right? There you go. Probably less of that, yeah? Okay. Less of this. Yeah, less of this, right. Okay. Go, go, go. Nicely done. Break it, break it, break it, break it. Identify, identify. Do I break too late? No, no, that's good. You're just on the gas too hard, right? You're on the gas. You're, you're taking a giant chunk of throttle. Breaking. There you go. You're killing our, our number one guy. Keep going, keep going. Again, looking, looking, start to look. So you know how to slow. Good man. That's it. That's it. Go, 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 go. Nicely done. Patience, patience. 
Don't force it. Don't force it. Go get him. Go get him. Later. Break later in here. Look before you turn. Thanks a lot. Big, I really feel the difference. Big improvement. Uh, never turn before you know where you're turning to. Yes. Yes. Thanks a lot, Nick. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. It was a pleasure. Doing this autocross is just so exciting, but it's also extremely hard work. I mean, I'm all wet. I need a new t-shirt, most definitely. You have to concentrate constantly. You have to be on really at the top of your game. But now it's time for another lap to practice. See ya. Towards the finish of the day, one of the big highlights comes, namely the autocross competition, where the 12 best drivers get to compete against each other for really fabulous prizes, like an IWC watch, an original AMG racing helmet, and other things. So here's the track, and each team is rooting its drive for its drivers. So watch this competition, and everyone is going to go haywalk here and try to score the best time. Despite two very demanding in it, but very exciting and fun days at the AMG Driving Academy at the advanced course, I still can't get enough. Not only did I get to drive all the exquisite AMG models like the SLS AMG, six, C63, E63, CLK63, Black Series, and of course, for the autocross, the SLK55, but also, I thought, I'm a pretty decent driver, but the Driving Academy really exposed many flaws that I have, especially a heavy foot on the throttle. But what's the upside? Well, I'm not leaving here depressed because I am not the best driver. No, I've actually learned quite a lot, and my lap times have improved continuously. So AMG Driving Academy really, really teaches you something, and you're having fun with the best cars in the world. So what's next? Well, I hope to see you guys at the Pro Academy. That must be a fantastic thing. But now, we're off to LA. See you there.